Uh, what's this? Oh, that's just a destroyed hive. Structural damage. Shit, 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 shit. Where do I go again? Let's see, let's see. Let me see. Combat damage to wall is heavy. Structural integrity. Heavy impact when it causes it to shatter. Fuck. Okay, okay, okay. Where did I used to go again? God, I can't remember. That's not it. Here it is! Kinetic Orb. Whee! Boom! Oh shit. Target trace amounts of unknown chemical present in target. It has an effect similar to mo modification on dead biomatter. Further analysis required to determine a chemical effect on living biomass. And here we are. We make it into the uh, temple grounds, I think. Turn on like the um, <laughs> into like this like little temple. I don't know, the temple. Boo! <laughs> the great temple. There we go. Targa has been dead for 8.1 cycles. Despite the presence of local animals, Targa corpse has been not been disturbed. Scans suggest the presence of a toxic bio biochemical within Targa. This may explain the lack of cor corrosion. Uh, uh, Karen, Karen, uh, feeding. Bioscans complete. Targa has been dead for 8.1 cycles. Target size and muscle mass suggest heavy combat training. It is likely that it was a warrior of some kind. The lack of gear, armor, or weapons is curious. Perhaps they were kind. They were taken by others of its kind. Area resource scan complete. Local save beacon is active. Safe station located. Hmm. Huh. That's very nice. <laughs> Could have told me that a little bit longer. A little bit, you know, earlier. Whoa, oh, oh my god! Bats! Batman! Damn it. It's the Bat Cave! Alright, if you can hear that, there is something down there. But you need uh, a power bomb for this part. And you won't get power bombs until later on in the game. Which sucks, I know it does suck. Unable to sub uh, scan object. Unknown energy field is scrambling the scan wave. Field is localized and holding a steady low. Further investigation. Nope, can't do anything about that. How nice. A dueling ring.
lucky I don't have the light. The light beam. Alpha Splinter. Alpha Splinter, Alpha Male of a War Pack. Gigantic Predator. Very swift and strong. It uses ramming attacks to defeat its foes. Splinter War Packs are dominated by the males, the largest male. Alpha Splinters use their tremendous strength, size, and speed to subdue and kill prey, paving the way for their smaller bloodling, bro, uh, broadlings. Oh my god! Damn it, they have to move so much so fucking fast. Oh my god! Oh, 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 yep, yep, you gotta gay it up. Gay it up. Yeah, just, you know what, I'm just gonna watch you. Dark Alpha Splinter. <laughs> alpha Male of a Dark on War Pack. Gigantic Predator with symbi uh, Symbiont Enhanced Strength. Speed and Armor. Ugh. Spawn for males are the first to be targeted for Dark Lung Possession. Dark Alpha Spawner strong strength and durability make them an even greater threat than normal. How grand. At least I get to get a freaking, you know. Oh, you don't! No, we don't. Miss time, you can't hit me. You can't hit me. I'm out of missiles. You can't hit me. You can't hit me. You are a bitch. You are slow. Oh shit, that almost hit me. You can't hit me. You can't hit me. You can't hit me. Too bad. Yeah, you better get pissed. Too bad, you're dead. Ah. Yeah. Stay down before I shoot you again. Ooh, I see the light. Light side of the force. Unknown technology. Alrighty. <laughs> what does this do? Touch. Oh, where are you going? Uh, ah. There can only be one. <laughs> system alert. Unknown item acquired. Alien technology has bound it to armor systems. Threat scan complete. No negative impact on suit performance. Yay. Can't go there, can't go there. Only way to go is forward. Units identify as hibernetic stasis chambers. Life signs of hibernation bioforms in the chamber are steady. Chambers are made of a number of exo exotic metals. They would be quite difficult to breach them with conventional weapons. Ooh, look at it. Power relays connected. Elevator unit online. Take me up, Scotty. I feel short. <laughs> I feel real short. Who's there? Do not be afraid. I am Umos, Sentinel of the Luminoth. Please listen and hear of our world's peril. Oh, I want to do that. <laughs> That's awesome. Long ago, a cosmic object fell onto our planet, Ether. Exploding with great force, a writ was torn in time and space, and a strange power flowed over the, over the world. 
there was where once there was one other, there were now two, one of light and one of shadow, existing in its own dimension. Ooh, pretty! No, it isn't. That shit's disgusting. It was that it was the end of peace on other for a new race was born that day of the on the dark world one filled with hate hate and terrible unlimited power they are emperor Hopting nana they're the ing the ing are creatures of shadow and darkness knowing nothing of peace or mercy for decades we stood against them yet we now lie on the verge of defeat When Dark Gather was born, our planetary energy was divided, half for our world and half for theirs. Should one world gain control of this energy, the other will perish. Shut up! Dog. Before you arrived, the Aang had stolen a device from us, one that collects planetary energy with it. They have, with it, they have weakened our planet to the verge of collapse. Shut up! Damn it. But fortune smiled upon us this day, for the energy transfer module is now bound to your booty. <laughs> With it, you can help us. Help us restore our world. Ha ha. You are our only hope, Samus. How the fuck do you know my name? <laughs> That's a question I want to know. Should we fall, the Ing will look to the stars for new planets to ravage and conquer. Your species will be their next victims. The Ing have taken our energy to three temples from Dark Ether. Find these temples and transfer the energy from them to our own. You have updated your... I have updated your map system with the location of another temple. There is knowledge there that can help you on your way. Thank you very much. I have also uploaded your translator module. You can now access div uh, devices door with doors co doors coated with violet holograms. Ming lands are now open to you. Sweet. Prepare well for your journey. The Eng now know you possess the energy transfer module. They will try to recover it at all costs. Return to me once you have restored the energy to a temple. I will aid you as I can. May the force be with you! No. May the light of ether shine upon you! The force! And I am the Pope! Behold my light and enlightening uh, thingies that are floating behind my arms or whatever. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Energy fully replenished. Luminoth. Indigenous sentient species. Subject Umos is a sentinel of the Lumanoth, guarded guardian of his species and his sacred temple. Subject is Uno, a sentinel and Lumanoth. Scans indicate la, la, la Fuck you. I don't care. Recording to logbook. Subject not is complete. This is a regional control center. Yeah, this is where they control the energy. Chamber holds a collection of several types of energy. Notable types include solar, bio, and geothermal energy. Unable to uh, measure exact power levels with certain current scan equipment. No, I don't want to talk with you. Oh, Argus Dark Shadow returns to the missing energy report. Aegon is lost. Oh, that's bomb! Look at that. He has a fucking barrier. Oh wait, I can scan this. Log. It is told that the Luminoth were not born of ether, but of the stars. In the early days, we roamed the greatness of the void, bathing in the glorious light of a thousand stars. We met a vast number of enlightened minds. The Yenkern, the Yao, and the Chozo among them. Each of them, we found, had claimed a homeworld and formed a deep bond with it. In time, we decided to do the same. I like the hero of music quota. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Beam me down to the planet below, Scotty. For I demand it. Yes, Captain Kirk. 